My name is LaVon Jackson and I'm an outreach coordinator for WCAC. I, I I wouldn't want to do anything else. Like, I mean, I wish somebody could have pulled me up and, and, and helped me the way I'm trying to help these women. Because it's it's so it's like it's so important to me that they get the information and they get the help and and learn. Like it's it's so much out there to learn about all these these these, these diseases and these the, 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 the uh, studies and stuff that they can get involved in. None of us knew back then about HIV. I, I, I can actually say that I, I, I've never even heard of it back then. Like maybe because I was using drugs and I wasn't paying attention, or nobody ever educated us, or whatever the case may be. But I didn't know about it. That that bothered me. And so when I started in this field and I and I was learning more and more, I started educating my family. Like. You can't get it like this. And I started taking pamphlets home so they can read it. So if they have the tools, I believe they would want to change. Because, I mean, you, you have to stop and think like, okay, I'm playing Russian roulette here. The men out there that you serve are not going to take care of you. You have to take care of yourself. You have to take control of what you're doing out there. We're not dumb women. We just make dumb decisions. We have groups at the drop-in center, we give them that information. We do groups about HIV, STIs, STD, STDs, and everything to take better care of their bodies, their health, and their minds so they can be more aware of what they're doing in, in their community and, and how they're affecting not just themselves, but they're affecting their families and up in, in the community. I believe if they can make a cure for other stuff, they have. they definitely can make a cure for this because I mean, they have all these studies, and people that are doing these studies have have is a success rate in this. So, if we if we as outreach workers or um, human service workers, we go out there and give people information, and I mean, if we have to pound it in them to get the information and and just make them aware, because it's, it's it's not a secret; it's affecting everybody. You know, and everybody needs to to be more aware and get education no matter where it's from MAC, WCAC, Roxcom, anywhere you can get the information you need to get that information because it's, it's detrimental to your health. It's something that you need to know. Because with street workers what they do is it's word of mouth. If I tell her she's going to tell somebody else. So when I tell them that they can go on MAC or they can go on WCAC or Facebook and, and get information and share it with people, that's what they can do. And I believe they will do that because that's something important they need to know.